In this video, we will try to solve a problem on Monopoly that was asked by a brother on Telegram channel of Econmaths. The question is like this. A Monopoly has following total cost and demand functions. We are being given the total cost function and demand function for a Monopoly. Cost function is Q square minus 10Q plus 50. Q denotes the quantity, C denotes the cost and demand function is P is equal to 70 minus Q. Okay. Uh, we have to write the total revenue function in terms of Q then we need to find out the equilibrium level of output find equilibrium price find profit maximizing level of output and the amount of maximum profit okay so let's uh, try to write what we are being given we have the cost function is q square minus 10 q plus 500 okay this is our total cost now demand function is being given as p is equal to 70 minus q okay first we are being told to find the total revenue function okay so first part is first part so total revenue as we know is simply equal to price into quantity okay price into quantity now p is 70 minus q so i can write it like this 70 minus q to this we multiply q that gives us uh, 70q minus q square okay this is our total revenue in terms of q okay now second part is find equilibrium price how do we find the equilibrium price for that we need to find out the equilibrium condition okay our equilibrium uh, condition in case of monopoly we know that our marginal revenue should be equal to marginal cost okay this is the equilibrium condition so what is our equilibrium uh, sorry what is our marginal revenue marginal revenue is simply the partial or the total derivative of uh, total revenue function with respect to quantity okay just take the um, derivative of total revenue function with respect to quantity what is our total revenue total revenue is this very stuff okay taking derivative the derivative of q is 1 so we are left with only 70 minus derivative of q square is 2q okay this 2 becomes coefficient and exponent is subtracted by 1 by power function rule this is our marginal revenue and what is marginal cost marginal cost simply is that derivative of cost function with respect to quantity okay what is cost function cost function is this very stuff so take the derivative with respect to q so the derivative of q square is 2q uh, then we have minus uh, derivative of q is 1 so we are left with 10 and derivative of a constant is obviously 0 okay we can grab this out also uh, to make uh, sense here we have this demand function let us say this is our demand function okay what is our marginal revenue marginal revenue function is same the intercept is here 70 and the uh, intercept of marginal revenue is also 70 so let's draw this let us say this is our marginal revenue function okay and what is our marginal cost function marginal cost function is 2q minus 10 okay so let us say this is our marginal cost okay equilibrium requires our marginal revenue should be equal to marginal cost this is our marginal revenue this is marginal cost so the intersection of these two gives us the equilibrium level of output okay how can we draw this so just equate marginal revenue and marginal cost marginal revenue is this stuff that is uh, 70 minus 2q and we equate it with 2q minus 10 okay this is our marginal revenue this is our marginal cost so taking this minus 10 to lhs so this becomes 70 plus 10 is equal to 2q taking this minus 2q this becomes 2q here which gives us 80 is equal to 4q which implies q is equal to 80 upon 4 
which comes out to be 20 that means our equilibrium level of output will be 20 okay so our equilibrium level of output is 20 and what will be the equilibrium price since this is our demand function what we also call average revenue function so corresponding to this equilibrium condition the equilibrium price will be here okay so just plug uh, q is equal to 20 okay in demand function demand function okay so this very function is actually 70 minus 2q okay this uh, line and this line is our marginal unit function which is 7 sorry it is 70 minus q only and this is 70 minus 2q okay this is our demand function and this is marginal revenue function okay just plug q is equal to 20 into de demand function we will get the price okay so plug in this demand function the value of equilibrium output that means our price will be equal to 70 minus 20 q is 20 which comes out to be 50 that means equilibrium level of price will be 20 sorry 50 here okay then uh, find profit maximizing level of output okay profit maximizing level of output will be also equal to 20 okay by equilibrium or profit maximizing level of output it is same in case of monopoly okay so equilibrium price will be 50 here <clears throat> then uh, the amount of maximum profit okay profit as we know profit is equal to total revenue minus total cost okay and what is total revenue price into quantity and what is total cost total cost function is being given us says q square minus 10 q plus 500 okay just plug the value of q here and the value of p so p we got as 70 sorry 50 so we have 50 into 20 minus q is 20 so let me write 20 square minus 10 into 20 plus 500 okay Joshua. so let me write it here now so 5 to the 10 hey hey where should i write this so let us do it like this so we have 5 to the 10 and we have two zeros okay then minus we have 20 into 20 is 400 minus 10 to the 200 plus sorry we have 500 here okay this is our profit so we have thousand minus mm, so run is the two hundred this is two hundred uh, plus five hundred which comes out to be one thousand minus five hundred two hundred is seven hundred that means profit maximum will be equal to uh, one thousand minus seven hundred comes out to be three hundred okay so this is it I hope I make myself clear in this video. Thank you.